Greetings people, it's King of I and I'm here with a short video to explain how version 2 of the cheapest heater in the world works. If you've seen my instructables.com slash King of I page, you would have seen step-by-step -step instructions how to construct this and you would have read some of the comments. So, in order to clarify how my system works and why it is so effective, I'm going to draw a diagram and explain it step by step. So, there is a small clay tray placed at the bottom. On it we place some feet in the configuration I show you on the second step. On top of that we place two pots, one inside the other. The smaller pots which are screwed together here and the holes are blocked. Very important, remember that. Underneath we place the candles. Then we place the other feet for the bigger clay pot and we place the second clay pot upside down over these two. Very important that this hole is actually open. It's quite a small one in reality. So what happens is as we turn on the candles, the candles heat up these two clay pots, essentially a massive ceramic heat sink. This will collect a lot of heat and it will slowly dissipate it in the surroundings. What happens, and this is where the difference is with other systems, this second pot on top allows for a gap underneath and a gap at the bottom. So it, it essentially becomes an air pump pulling cold air all the way from round the bottom then passing it through the hot chamber and as it rises heats it up which then escapes through the middle hole creating a column of air rising to the top of the room as the hot air cools down goes back down and this cycle is continual if you don't believe me all you gotta do is check my step-by-step -step instructions on instructables.com slash king of i make it run it for a day or two and let me know how it hits up your room and how effective it is at what it says it does remember this is not the same like all the crappy ones you see online this is the king of i version and it works fantastic blessed vibes sending out to all of you and i hope you have a warm warm winter